nowhere in the Bible that a man should marry one wife and neither is it a sin to marry more than one. And now that he knows the secret, he will continue to marry as many women as possible so as to end respect from God in heaven. Hello guys, hello people, my people. <laughs> Well, that shall never end. We could meet uh, Pastor Mugabe, Abi Mugaba, what did they call the man? When he married four wives one day, the man often married one wife before as a pastor for many years. So now the man saying, don't discover and say, God no day against polygamy and see where verse day for Bible when he actually cover up to be polygamy to get many wives that's okay i go want make we watch this video together i beg no fail to share this video so that it could make we they follow the new update of the bible make we for know where we did move no call lost so now i go want make all of us uh, watch this one together okay guys he says there is nowhere in the bible that a man should marry one wife and neither is it a sin to marry more than one and now that he knows the secret he will continue to marry as many women as possible so as to end respect from God in heaven. This is Pastor Zazabe Chiluza from the Democratic Republic of Congo who married four wives and says this is what the scripture says. We were invited to attend a special wedding and it's one of the most extraordinary. He's called Brother Zagabe Chiluza and he's a pastor in Eglise Primitive de Seigneur. Today, he's marrying four girls, and he will never stop marrying virgins. Zagabe does not do this because of lust, and he gives many biblical scriptures showing that marrying more than one woman isn't a sin. And many people in the Bible who married many wives were always respected by God. He jokes that, show me why it's written that a man should marry only one wife. I'm called Zagabe Chiluza. I have one wife, plus these four that I'm about to marry today. They will have to join the senior wife. Today we have to celebrate me and other believers. I marry more women, and the idea originates from the Bible, and our church tells us so. To many people, this does not make sense as a pastor who should be exemplary. In 1986, when I was in school, that's when I got saved and believed Jesus as my savior. Me and my colleagues always talk about the Bible. And when it comes to polygamy, we differ from other religions as we all have different opinions on this topic. Jacob married one wife and was awarded another one, didn't he? After that, he married others that we don't even know about. There are a lot of examples, let's say Solomon, David and more. Was God not pleased with them? I'm wondering how can one refuse to marry more women? While attending this special wedding, it was not only us, but many from his church. Friends and families also gathered to attend Pastor Zagabe's wedding, a man whom God anointed. They sang songs of praise while dancing. The groom and bride arrive. I'm glad to have five wives around me. No, I can only see four. If you want to marry a lot of wives like Abraham, say amen. Rejoice with us, and Abraham will see you though he's seated in heaven. May God bless you. As time gets by, everything gets better and better. This church is governed according to prophecy and holy scriptures. I'm not yet married but agree with polygamy. God himself supports polygamy as Apostle Paul said. It is said that in heaven there will only be virgins and hope it makes sense. We are getting them married, laying hands on them while asking blessings 
for them to produce girls and boys who are doing what is written in the Bible and God is pleased with this marriage. I'm called Brother Kalebe, a pastor in this church, and polygamy was introduced by God in the Old Testament and the whole Bible. You can read Matthew 25, chapter 1. It reads, At that time, the kingdom of heaven will be like ten virgins who took their lambs and went out to meet their bridegroom. We are here to meet the groom, and you understand well that all brides will be his. Isn't that clear? So, when I watch this video right now, so they say there for Matthew, for those of you who <laughs> say uh, God, nae, so God supports polygamy. Say God no get problem, even there for Bible. So, my people, when I see what I talk, when I talk, say, to marry many wives, many wives na choice. I talk and before, and then they repeat them again. So, marry wives, now choice but these people now when i see the way this world they go now pastor now be this one when he get one wife before according to they say uh the man say no day bible say god say me that they marry one wife mm. say no day bible don't read bible in a pastor so but in the bible old testament where you feel marry where god for support polygamy and uh, because people wait there for bible where god like many of them are polygamy they, they, they get many wives so god, god no get problem with that one so for them now to they marry those wives god no go still get problem i talk her before now choice if you be woman where they watch me right now you don't like polygamy you don't want me my marriage or you not choice okay so no be the i know say so maybe people when when uh, when they go to church when they when they go you hear what they go just kind of you know come on and say okay god support polygamy okay you know so now na pastor's time to marry now no be you a doche oh with they now with their pastor this one a pastor when he marry four women one day and he talks say no be saying love them but because god support god we he please um i mean he like people when he create polygamy when he get polygamous home when marry many wives god support them for bible for old testament so for that reason he want make god you want to please God as well. So getting married to many wives, you they actually please God according to these pastors. Okay, I be this. So I see that young girl when talk say she never marry, but she go. I, I see they see and as their pastor talk her, polygamy now no be problem. Meaning for future, if somebody want marry a joint thirteen wife, fourteen wife, she go agree. Anyway, you know say mona no forget say they for Bible the same Bible say if end time don't come like this, don't they reach. Now, so things go, they happen. What do you think? You think saying that truth as this pastor talk and say they for Old Testament, say God support polygamy. So drop out that the comment section below. Share this video. One that shall never end now with this. So, mm, thank you all guys for being here. My name remain Jama First Lady. Like, subscribe, and drop your comments under the comment section below. Stay blessed, guys. And then, bye.